Good morning guys and welcome back to Free Space. Uh, for those of you who may or may not want to know, I will not be taking care of Silent Threat or Free Space 2, which really, really annoys me because I really want to play Free Space 2. Uh, but I won't be doing those right away. I will eventually be doing those. Uh, but they will also be individual playthroughs. They won't be... Um, oh, they won't be part of this playlist they'll have their own playlists and everything so once free space is done free space one is done and then silent threat will be its own playthrough and all that all right so there is little left for us little time but much irony we did discover they are not invulnerable the destroyers that darkened our skies like a plague can be harmed. But we have no way to deliver the hurt. We have the knowledge, but not the means. And so this is our legacy. In subspace, they cannot use their shields. And into subspace, they can be tracked. We have successfully extracted the records from Altair 4. They have been partially deciphered and are being moved back to Terran space. Omega Transports will once again be handling the movement of the scientists and the records. Unfortunately, the Altair system is still controlled by the Hammer of Light. One of their flagships, the Anvil, is stationed here and has gotten word of our presence in this system. It is currently blocking the vector to the subspace node. The Anvil carries with it a powerful contingent of Asudan fighters. Intelligence reports two squadrons, one of advanced TOS space superiority fighters and one of Horus interceptors. These fighters have defended the Anvil well. Intelligence has also detected the presence of a third wing of Asudan bombers in the system. They will undoubtedly try to attack our fleeing transports. Your strike force will once again consist of Alpha, Beta, and Gamma wings. Gamma will provide escort for Alpha, while Alpha attacks the Anvil. Beta will ensure the safety of the transports and maintain our fighter superiority. The Anvil must be destroyed. We are equipping Alpha with Harbinger bombs. These bombs require exact placement and careful maneuvering, but will do massive damage to the Anvil. Beta and Gamma must ensure that the Harbingers reach their target. Our primary goal, however, is to ensure that Omega-1 and Omega-2 reach the jump node. Destroying the Anvil is the best way to ensure that this goal is accomplished. This mission is of grave importance. Do not fail, pilot. Good luck. Alright, so, yeah. Um, I went through this already, and, uh, up, set up my ship. Uh, basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have Gamma and beta wings protect the transports while I send Alpha off to attack the, uh, the ship. Now the reason that's important is because, okay, I need to transfer that down there. I'm going to be putting a lot of faith in Alpha 2. So Alpha 2 is going to be carrying a whole bunch more Harbinger bombs than everybody else. So Alpha 2, if you die, I'm going to be gravely disappointed. Uh, these are pretty much useless. Uh, actually, you know what? That's a good point. I can actually do that. Um, and then that. Dang. Uh, so Alpha 3... I mean, Alpha 4 is going to basically be outfitted with a whole butt-ton of those. Alright, so hopefully the joystick's working this time. Alright, make sure joystick is working. New hostiles in the area! Cool, two, two, five. Yes, sir!
Affirmative, sir. I have absolutely no idea who's protecting who. I'm on it. I'm on it. There. That's the easiest way to do this. Two. Attacking now, sir.
duly noted, time for me to get my happy butt out here. Speaking of which, where is... So you are at 6,000, about 7,000 meters away. It looks like we made it. Jumping to Deneb. We're jumping out now, sir. Call two, no, call three. Target acquired. Oh, no you don't. I know what's about to happen here. The anvil is down! Nice work, Alpha! Everybody get clear, because this is gonna hurt. Correctly, I'm on something it. else is about to happen here. I think. I know we're fairly close to the end. I'll probably do one more mission if there's not. Okay, uh huh. Good, good, good. Oh, there's not. Alright, so we'll send everybody home. Call three. That's affirmative, sir. Departing now. Call one, one, three. That's affirmative, sir. Departing now. Alright. I've given it a 60 seconds, so it should be long enough. Per GTAR 64 Attack 2A, you are hereby promoted to the rank of Lieutenant. Congratulations. Mission accomplished, pilot. We haven't yet been briefed on the full importance of the ancient records, but Terran Command is extremely pleased. Further orders are expected soon. It is impressive that you managed to destroy a primary flagship of the Hammer of Light. Perhaps this will put an end to their resistance. Fighting the Hammer of Light has been a great strain on the Terran Vesudan Alliance. So, we're going to go ahead and do another mission. The Shivans have finally determined the location of the Soul System. The Lucifer has moved into position here in Sirius for the subspace jump to Delta Serpentis. From Delta Serpentis, she will certainly make the jump to Soul to destroy our homeworld. From the records you retrieved in Altair, we have discovered the means to destroy the Lucifer. As you know, our shield systems do not work in subspace. The same holds true for the Lucifer. More importantly, the records contain the information to enable us to track a capital ship into and inside subspace. If we can track the Lucifer into subspace, we believe a small strike force may be sufficient to destroy it. We have been assigned the task of destroying the Lucifer before she reaches Seoul. The Bastion is currently en route to intercept the Lucifer at the Sirius Delta Serpentis subspace node. The Bastion will attempt to provide close cover while Ursa bombers deliver a payload of Harbingers. We believe that without the shielding system it's relied on so heavily, the Lucifer will be vulnerable. Keep in mind that this is a time-critical operation. If we do not enter subspace soon after the Lucifer, we cannot launch our attack. From your earlier scans of the Lucifer in the Deneb system, we have determined that it is powered by five primary reactors. These reactors are spread out across the Lucifer. If all five reactors are destroyed in a short period of time, the Lucifer won't have a chance of surviving. We don't have much time. Report for mission briefings immediately. We have few chances to stop the Lucifer. It is heading to the Soul System, but we have an opportunity to head them off at Sirius. If you encounter the Lucifer in Sirius, hold it off until the rest of the fleet can catch up with you. Well, so apparently as it turns out, doing this last mission was actually a good thing because welcome to the end game. Um... Yes, but, see, it only has one missile bank, and I really need more than one. 
so does the rest of Alpha Wing. Don't be wrong, it's quick and, you know, highly maneuverable, but... Actually, no, the Prometheus would be better. Prometheus does very high. A whole bunch of damage to shields. I mean, uh, Prometheus does a whole bunch of damage to hulls. You guys still have your setups, right? This video is going to require a lot of editing. Where's the other one at? Oh, uh, you mean to tell me I don't have the... Uh, I need to focus on those bombers. Yeah, it does say, look, it says Alpha, Beta, and Gamma. So, where is Gamma Wing? Hmm, I'm going to have to review that old footage, but I don't remember seeing Gamma Wing. Huh. Check that out when I get in the game. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we'll do. Here's what we'll do. We'll take the old setup. We'll switch. Because those disruptor missiles suck. Granted, they work. They just suck. So we'll try this setup. Yeah. Where is Gamma Wing? No sign of the Lucifer. We'll have to proceed to Delta Serpentis. Yes, sir. Enemy Wing has just arrived. I'm on it. This looks like an ambush! Yes, it is an ambush. Protect the Bastion! Yes, protect the Bastion.
just arrived. First couple groups get launched fairly quickly. It's almost like I need you guys to come in.
Activity is dropping. We need support. Yeah, we're
The GTD bastion is in prime condition to assault the Lucifer. We are proceeding to Delta Serpentis now. <laughs> 